My name is A.S. Panir Silvan. I'm executive director of Panos South Asia. The most poignant image which remains in my mind whenever we talk about human rights is the image of Nelson Mandela. It was posters done by a local activist group. It was a time when India was talking about non-colonialization or decolonialization of Africa. It was taking up the cause of PLO. PLO embassy was open in India. Mrs. Gandhi was talking about the third world movement and the non-aligned movement. So this particular image was Nelson Mandela in a football attire, but behind bars. What did it do to us? It actually raised a fundamental question of what is human rights? Is human rights restricted only to Africa? And the, one of the slogans in this thing is there are many Mandelas everywhere. And that actually drew us to Universal Declaration of Human Rights, Geneva Convention, the rights of the prisoners, and then it also tied up with two or three major developments in India. One was the emergency excesses, another one was the Bhagalpur eye blinding case. Bhagalpur is a place in Bihar where the inmates were blinded by the authorities and it created such a huge ruckus. And every person who was blinded was also called a Mandela. So Mandela became a symbol of both resistance as well as a symbol which can make people to come together and fight against these type of human rights abuses.